Hey guys, welcome back to a Bloodthirsty Vampire walkthrough. This is part 4, so if you haven't seen the other parts, go check them out. So apparently, if uh, you're bloodthirsty and uh, you really kill everything in sight, you kind of lose uh, the element of getting the districts and everyone gets crazy. So that's exactly what I'm going to do. So with that being said, let's continue. Let's see. Can I open this? I cannot enter. Of course you can't. We'll have a word in my office later, Jonathan. Okay then. Nice to meet you too. Oh yeah, by the way. So, well, not this. Where is it? There we go. Okay, so those are a faces here so you can actually add stuff so we have a, a used machete I'm gonna actually use a scythe because that does a lot of damage and then let's get the bludgeon the offhand let's use yeah let's use a revolver Actually, why not use this? There we go. Okay. Serums, I don't have any. Yep, completely nothing. Oh, I can't wait to get the, the ultimate. Okay. These are just passive things. That's pretty cool. I did not know I can use that. So let's uh, let's see how this is. I can't use it. Nah, it's my turn. Whoa. What's going on? Each heart contains the seed of life. Drink at this river. Try it all. Sure thing. <laughs> oh, come on, you bastard. I won't bite. Sir, please. You've lost too much blood. Calm yourself. You think I didn't notice? Stop your staring and get me to an hospital, you ass! I will kill you. Insult me again and I'll put an end to your misery right now. All right, all right, sorry. I am in pain here. My guts are spilling out onto the street and you're yabbering on. Yes, that's a very nasty wound you've got there. Take my word, I was... I am a doctor, Dr. Jonathan Reed. <sighs> Name's Clay Cox. I'd appreciate you helping me to a better place, Doc. Follow me, Mr. Cox. Let me assist you to that better place. Okay, how do I... How do I kill this dude and eat him? To drink the blood of your prey, you first need to mesmerize them to lead them out of sight from others. Okay. What do I do now? Bring this fading light into the shadows. Dance with him the dance of life and death. What? Embrace Clay or release him? Oh, hell yeah, I'm gonna. I'm a savage vampire. Savage, bloodthirsty vampire. In the back, you bastard! Didn't have the guts to fart me. Fuck you! I'll kill you! I'll kill you! You can't, you're dead. I just killed you, actually. Unless you come back to life, uh. Don't know what I'm gonna do there. Let's see what's over here. To taste a life, to embrace its most intimate secrets. Such a burden, such a divine sin. Okay. Check what's in here aluminum powder. What would a vampire do with aluminum powder? Hey, look. Ooh, 
people to kill. Doctor, where have you been? I've little time to play hide and seek with new staff members, no matter how illustrious they may be. I apologize, nurse. I needed some time to myself. This has been the longest and strangest night of my life. You delivered poor Mr. Hampton from a terrible fate. The means to that end should be of little concern, Doctor. Thank you, nurse. What can I do for you? Dr. Swansea insisted we provide you a quiet office. You'll find it on the second floor with your name on the door. Thank you. Nurse Crane, isn't it? Yes, Dorothy Crane. Welcome to Pembroke Hospital, Dr. Reed. Your office has been prepared. Thank you. Let's see, let's I see the like questions. I'd like to ask a few questions first. Who is Dr. Swansea? What kind of man is Dr. Swansea? Well, you accepted the job from him. I thought you would have known about your employer. Woman? I'm about to feed on your blood. It's right to assume Dr. Swansea knows far more about me than I do about him. You'll get to know him soon enough, and better than me. The administrator has better things to do than mix with us. Alright, whatever. This lazy... Lazy. This lady seems dis... Interested. And quite frankly, so am I. Thank you, Nurse Crane. Hey, buddy. Okay. What did I do? I just... Press the talk. What's going on? Good evening, sir. I'm Dr. Jonathan Reed. I'm new here. I've already heard about you, Dr. Reed. I'm Milton Hooks, the ambulance driver for this shithole of a hospital. That's quite a blunt introduction, Mr. Hooks. You can call me Milton. I like to speak my mind, Dr. Reed. Perk of the job. Don't judge me, and I won't judge you. I'm not sure I understand what you're talking about. Well, I'm no doctor, but I'm pretty sure a gun can't be used as a surgical instrument. You have a keen eye. I learned to shoot during the war, and have carried one ever since. Old habits die hard. No need to explain, Dr. Reed. And if you ever need a better gun, remember, I may have something for you. Ooh. Let's trade. I'd like to see your goods. Wise choice, Dr. Reed. A reliable gun is what everybody needs these days. I'm assuming the green is what I can buy. Ooh, nice shotgun. Standard bullet for a revolver. Okay. I have 32. Common trigger part. Okay, I'm definitely getting the shotgun. If I can. Oh, I can't. What else is there? I'm gonna get some shotgun shells. And I will get some bullets. And maybe a common trigger part. That's about it. Where's my office? Can't believe they got me one already. Okay, not in here. Who said that? I didn't even hear anything. This is a... Why is it always raining in this town? Dr. Swansea is right. This place seems perfect to conduct my research. Yes. Good evening, nurse. Good evening, doctor. I don't think we've been introduced yet. My name is Pippa Hawkins. And I'm Dr. Jonathan Reed. Dr. Swansea has recently offered me a position in this hospital. Well, it's a euphemism that your help will be appreciated, Doctor. Okay. Guess we can ask you some personal questions. Hint required, whatever. Don't need to know about you anyway. Uh... How would you describe the situation at the Pembroke Hospital? It's serious. The flu is wreaking havoc amongst the staff and patients. 
We are running out of everything. Get a grip, lady. You must get a hold of yourself, nurse. <sighs> Sorry. I'm exhausted. No one has any idea when this epidemic will be over. I mean, I can end it for you. Just need your blood. Can I just... What if I do goodbye? Goodbye, Nurse Hawkins. Can I just take this woman? Ah, uh, no. You can't just take everyone. Just trying to see if you could just, uh, open world take everyone. Whoa. Good evening, Doctor. I believe we're going to be working together. Dr. Reed. Dr. Swansea informed us of your arrival, but I could not dare to believe we'd have such good fortune. Such an honor, sir. <laughs> Thank you. And you are? I am Thoreau Strickland. Dr. Thoreau Strickland. I'm a great admirer of your work, Dr. Reed. Honestly, these uh, conversations are very dull. It's mainly just praise. I want to learn more about the lore of vampires and stuff like that. Sure, tell me about Please, yourself. could you tell me something about yourself? I'm a great admirer of your work concerning blood transfusion, Dr. Reed. I run my own experiments. I'm convinced it's the future. Tell me about them. I based my technique on my mentor's research. He helped me perfect my method. What is yours? I'd rather not talk about it. For now, it's just theories and first approach. My process is purely experimental and unsuccessful. As long as you're cautious and methodical, you may remain empty-handed, but you won't fail. You're not the first one to warn me, but I am convinced knowledge is the main weapon against the ravages of this epidemic. Yeah, until you die. Do you need my medical attention, dear colleague? You don't have to worry about me, Dr. Reed. I am here to assist you, not to be a burden. I can't mesmerize him. I'm only a level one. Ah. Uh, so you can't mesmerize Goodbye, everyone. Can I mesmerize her? What can I do for you, Doctor? Uh, nothing. Thank you, Nurse Crane. Never mind. I will not let you. Good evening, sir. I'm Dr. Reed. May I help you? I don't know if a third opinion is needed. Your colleagues are already arguing about my condition. I see. Would you mind telling me more about your situation? I'm Harvey Fiddick. All I want is to get me bloody arm fixed properly. Oh, I'll help you get it fixed. I'll help you get it real fixed. Where do I take him? Let's take him uh, right over here. Don't waste your time with me. Oh man. Where can I take this guy? Just trying to fix his arm. Don't mind me. Is this place good over here? Oh, there's outside. Let's go into the shadows. What kind of hospital is this? Just letting their patients walk outside? I guess I'm a renowned doctor, but... Still. Um, let's see if this alleyway does it. Alright, buddy. What? What just happened? Wait, 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 come back here. Good evening, Mr. Fiddick. Good evening, Dr. Reed. Any news about my operation? No. I just want to... Come on. Let's continue on this way. Oh, we can't go there. Well, let me find a... Into the shadows place. Is this a good place? Seems like a good place. Let's 
What was that? Oh, okay. Maybe I could take him here. Where'd he go? Hey, RV. How you doing, buddy? Good evening, Mr. Fiddick. Good evening, Dr. Reed. Any news about my operation? I don't know. We're about to find out. Okay, so we have some mind controlling. It's only letting me release. But I don't want to release. Oh, is it telling me where to go? Are these shadows telling me where to go? Oh, yes, it is. Oh, yes, it is. Bye bye. Drum roll. All I wanted was to go back to work to take care of my children. Oh, no. All right. Okay, if you only told me that beforehand, maybe something could have happened. But no. Can I pick this guy up and make it look not so suspicious? Look at that XP. Look at that XP. Hey, buddy. Good evening, sir. I'm Dr. Reed. I believe we're going to be colleagues. Reed? Yes, I've been informed about your arrival. I'm Waverly Aykroyd. Welcome aboard, I suppose. Does my arrival inconvenience you in some way, Dr. Aykroyd? Let us just say that I don't particularly share Dr. Swans's enthusiasm for hiring you. What we need here are reliable professionals, not overrated dabblers. I need to pick his mind or something? I don't understand how to... Let's see. It seems you have bad memories of your military service. I refuse to see this industrial slaughter as scientific progress. War only reveals the worst in men. We can at least agree on something, Dr. Aykroyd. Yeah, I don't understand this mesmerized thing. I will look it up later. But, uh, yeah. Thank Bye. Thank you for your time. We'll talk later. This is the lady that, uh, you know. What about you, lady? Good evening, madam. Can I help you? It's my son who needs you, sir. I'm Dr. Jonathan Reed. How can I help your son? I'm Beatrice Goswick, mother of Mortimer Goswick. Could you check on him, please, Dr. Reed? I've heard much of your talents as a physician. Sure. Uh, you know, these people are not interesting at all. Just gonna have to say. Goodbye, Mrs. Goswick. What Good do you evening. need? I'm Dr. Reed. Can I help at all? No. Really? Why are you here then? I don't want to talk. My throat hurts too much. I suppose that this pain is the reason you're here. Is someone taking care of you? Yes. And no. Could you at least tell me your name, sir? Mortimer. Mortimer Goswick. Can I mesmerize this guy? Nope. Level two. Waste of my time. I have to go now, sir. But don't hesitate to contact me if you need any help. By the way, I'm just uh, joking. When I... Uh, do these blood bloodthirsty things. I'm just trying to make this character go insane. You know what I'm saying? So let's go up. To the Ooh, you look like a victim. Good evening, Miss. I'm Doctor Reed, the new surgeon at the Pembroke Hospital. And who are you? Your name has no meaning to me, mortal. You're nothing but dust blown by the winds of eternity. I beg your pardon. What are you begging for, mortal? My clemency. Well, tonight maybe I'm inclined to mercy. You'll never forget the night you met Thelma Howcroft. You keep calling me mortal. Why is that? And if I'm mortal, what are you? Well, Dr. Reed, if you must know, I'm a vampire. 
Ah, uh, she's level two. Can I give you a medical checkup? Do you require my services, Miss Howcroft? I have no need for your medicine, Dr. Reed. Blood is the only drug I need. Okay. Goodbye. I'll leave you, Mistress of the Dark, to your nocturnal activities. Let's go to the main quest. Or main, uh... Let's just find my room. Not now! Oh, oops. Wonder what he was doing in there. What's in here? Ooh. A used hacksaw? I want it. There has been no action in this this part of the game. It's locked, all right. That's my name. This must be the place. It's definitely away from prying eyes. Whoa, this is Relegated huge. Relegated to the shadows. A kingdom of my own. At least I won't be sleeping in a coffin. Was that in his way a kind of a joke? What is that? I asked Nurse Crane to secure an office for you in the second floor. Please forgive me. We shall talk soon. Yeah, that was nice of you. Right, this was kind of a... Well... I guess this was an introduction to... Wait, hold on. Maybe I'm not done yet. Treatments to analyze. Blood sample. Ooh. Okay. You have enough components to improve one of your weapons. Press R2. Okay. Since I haven't used any of them. How about we uh, select a melee weapon to upgrade it? Clay's hatchet. I do like using hatchets. Let's upgrade this hatchet. Okay. Nice. Nice. I guess we're gonna have to. William Bishop's blood is much more unstable than human blood and shows extensive mutation. But this is not what happened to me. I must keep on searching. Okay, so that the was the last boss. To rise. I can feel it. I'll continue tomorrow night. Oops. Not this one. No. I have st There we go. Let's put the hatchet in. After the hatch yeah, yeah, let's, let's put those two weapons. Offhand, let's put that revolver. Trying to equip it. Guess I can't. Nothing there either. You drain your own blood to heal. Oh wow. I did not know that happened. Level. Mesmerize. It's just. Okay so my power level is 4. And my mesmerize level is 1. So it's separate. Okay, that's cool, that's cool. So much time. Alright, I think this is going to be it, guys. So we learned how to... How to mesmerize and kill. So we can become the bloodthirsty vampire. Uh, yeah, that would be great. If you liked the video, leave a like. And subscribe for more videos to come. See you guys next time.